Why, hello, my Shopties. How is everybody today? I am comfy. I am cozy. I am straight vibing. I got more sleep today. Yay! So I am feeling much better than I have been uh, these past couple days. I got an actual half decent amount of um, sleep today. So that's very exciting. And uh, we are back with Kirby and the Forgotten Lands. Um, I am also back in my starry blanket. Uh, for my comfy games, you will see me in this little uh, blanket here, meaning that it's going to be a, a, a looser. I forgot that you could go through the <laughs> the fireplace um meaning that it's going to be a more uh comfortable kind of game so yeah that's kind of what we're doing um it's kirby in the forgotten lands today lots of fun lots of fun times um my neck hurts <laughs> that's like the one thing i will gripe about is that i do have a very sore neck today um so we will be struggling with that man we're only like 53 percent done jeez i'm scared of how long this game is um but let me see what we got to do today wow hello d um is there any new coliseum stuff to do no no new coliseum all right, so then if that's the case, then it's just uh, finishing up the actual plot of the game. So to the world. We even completed the, the gotcha collection, the, the figure collection, which is exciting. Oh, yeah, we're back here. I see. Um, I think... We just have to do the boss and uh, yeah 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 very much that day i was hoping people would be like what what are what is this and then i'd be able to get them um so we're gonna be doing the treasure roads real quick uh and then the treasure roads will probably keep me occupied until break uh so we're gonna get two hours of this um Uh, and in, in that, that scenario, you know. Alright, let's see. Do, 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 do. Oh, fooey. Um. How are you today, Jay, by the way? You doing well? You vibing? Enjoying your prolonged vacation, hopefully? Come here. I am very focused in. This is a, a bit of a, a slow round here. Cool. All right. Nice. I took pain killer, slept a bit, and now I'm good. Oh, I hate headaches. Maybe you like overslept or something. Or, you know, maybe it's just referred pain because that happens a lot. I hope you feel better soon. Nobody likes headaches. So, do feel better soon. Yeah, take medicine. The mind goblin. Come here. Come here. Wah. 
There we go. I don't know if I did this fast enough, but... Oh, I definitely didn't. I think I, I had to shave off two seconds. Jay, I'm gonna drown you in a, in a bird bath. That's what I'm gonna do to you. I hope you know. <laughs> Just you wait until Saturday when we're playing Minecraft. I'll make sure friendly fire's on. <laughs> I'll hide your body in the depths of that cave we found and, and the world will never know. That cave was hilarious, by the way. Like that, that whole scenario. I'm restarting. That whole scenario of you finding that cave was absolutely incredible. My job here, it's not. <laughs> Jack Grizz is in here. Grizz loves watching uh, Kirby and the Forgotten Lands. I'm shocked. I'm shocked they're not here. A little strange. Yeah. Grizz manifests and it's like you called. Hell yeah! Look at that. Um, I believe it's that way. Come here. Nice. Okay. No! Oh no, I'm getting buried in that. Yeah, the, consider this the Pharaoh's curse. Come on, we got this. Kirby doesn't run fast enough. He's so slow. He doesn't run fast enough. <laughs> All right, uh, we're gonna go back to the D town and make Kirby fast and strong. Yeah. Yeah. <gasps> That's all. Excuse me. I just need like one of each of these, I think. Because it'll give me 200 seconds of each. And instead of just like... Yeah, faster Kirby! Faster! This will make things easier, I think. God, the fucking music every time. It's like the aggressive synths. It's angry at me. I worked out today. 
and I had a, a migraine. I still have a migraine, but it's it's less aggressive than it was. And now I'm like thinking that I've I'm dehydrated because <laughs> now I'm drinking my uh, liquid IV and I'm starting to feel a little better. That's what I get for taking a shower right before bed. If you don't know, showers dehydrate you, fun fact. So if you didn't know, now you do. Showers dehydrate you, especially if they're hot. I'm down here. Ooh. All right. And that should go up. Yeah. <gasps> ah! All right. This might be a good time to try again. <laughs> Incredible. Uh, outstanding. I'm moving so speedy quick. as fuck boy all right ah stop dragging me over here i got 30 seconds That was so good. And snatch. Okay. Good job on getting first for the first time ever, Chat Nubis. I'm so proud of you. <laughs> All right. Twin drill treasure. I don't know what to expect here. I'm a little scared. I think I got it, actually. Yes, no, maybe so? 
Yeah! <laughs> Look at that! Okay! Alright, so we're gonna go back to the, the D-Town. Get some more, um... Um... Of the energy drinks, and then... Upgrade a few more, um... Weapons. So that way we could do the rest of the, uh... Treasure roads. I have so much fucking money. I could just like max them out. I think I will so that way I don't have to keep coming back here. Because it does make the treasure roads significantly easier. And I mean, eating more of them, like drinking, drinking, I guess, because you're not eating them. Drinking them does make it a lot uh, longer. Like, you won't have to go back as often to restock, but. Like, you're saving time. That's why you would buy multiple at once and just stock up. Yeah! Alright, now we're, we're gonna become super fast. Okay, so, uh, since y'all are here, I have a- and I'll be asking this a couple times throughout, uh, the stream but i have a, a question for you guys um just out of curiosity my fellow vtubers out there which do you think is more important to do first upgrade your camera or upgrade your pc so like if you had to pick one to upgrade right here right now would you pick to upgrade your camera first or would you pick to upgrade your pc first just out of curiosity. Very curious to hear what you guys would do. It's a dilemma I myself am facing. I'm like, I use a webcam and a kind of crummy PC. So I'm like, uh, should I upgrade my camera first and get better tracking and let my stream stay at the same quality that it's been at? Or should I uh, switch to... Uh, PC. PC because you usually start as a PNG tuber and the camera doesn't matter. That's fair. But what if you already have a model? Because I know some people buy like pre-made models off of uh, websites and use them. Usually means buying an iPhone to be honest. It does because iPhone has in impeccable tracking. It's like the best tracking right now. I wish more cameras would come out to fit this niche because you know but there's not a lot of use for that outside of vtubing like not a lot of um cameras need face recognition as high as of a degree as face id does so i mean you could theoretically set up your pc to unlock whenever you got close to it which i mean is oh my god space ranger kirby <laughs> which is a, a a one reason that i could think of that you would um that's so cute and then like this little star oh my god <gasps> oh shit oh my god this is absolutely amazing <laughs> I love that so much. Um. Oh, this this is the Max Sword one. That's nice. 
Okay, so it looks like Crash probably has one more upgrade. Um, the Tornado has one more upgrade. Sleep has two, it looks like. Okay, cool. Just wanted to see how many upgrades were left on everybody. Good to know that the max of the sword is Meta Knight, because that makes me happy. Uh, anyway, um, it's hard to put into perspective, too, because a PC upgrade is usually a grand or two, and the iPhone is what I put above. Yeah, the iPhone, iPhone costs, like, anywhere between, depending on how new you're getting it, between, like, 100 to, like, $800, which is a lot for a phone. It's just a, quite a bit. Um, so I know that I personally want to get like uh, two or three phones for this job, <laughs> like VTubing. Uh, one for face tracking and whatnot and business calls and stuff like that. One for like gaming uh, that just doesn't have any service, but specifically for gaming because there are mobile games. I would get more of like an iPad for that, though, I think like a... Well, not an iPad, but like uh, a tablet kind of structure uh, for that. And then like a personal phone that works. Although I wouldn't go for iPhone for that. <laughs> iPhone sucks in terms of phones. Um, so eventually that is something I do want to save up for. So that way I could keep my information separate. Because nobody likes when your information is shared online and, you know, making it nearer impossible to get that information probably smart but yeah that's just personal preference for me uh but i'm glad that most people are on on the agreements that a uh, pc is the smarter thing to start off with because like webcam tracking is bad but it's not like horrible yeah no i would never give anyone my private number fuck that shit <laughs> yeah. i don't care if it costs more for an extra phone line i'm i'm going for the I'd I'd pay the extra like couple hundred for um a business phone, you know? Have an agreement on one person. Well, I've asked other people outside of chat too what their opinions on are on it are, and uh, so far everybody has been saying that invest in the PC first because it's better to improve your stream as a whole than it is to just improve one aspect of it. Uh, if you're gonna work on it, and I was like, yeah, that's true. So I'm glad most people are like, yeah, do this. Good night. Thank you. Oh my god, can I not? This is this is annoying. <laughs> oh my god, hydrate. Yeah, also better PC means you can play more games. I yeah, that's true, too. It also means you can get more creative with your streams.
and do stuff that you otherwise wouldn't be able to do. Like, you'd be able to have more collabs, you'd be able to uh, work faster and harder on things that otherwise you wouldn't have been able to do. Your, like, efficiency just goes up with a higher quality PC because everything moves faster. So you can work to your specific speed on things. Can you? Oh my God. There we go. God, this is taking forever. Please let that be that, because I don't want to do this one again. This one's annoying. Um, yeah, you can support bigger screen. You can have more monitors, all that stuff. You can manage more things like stream statistics, stuff like that. Um, also, thank you, No, for the hydrate. Good job, Jay, on getting second. And I have been hydrated. <clears throat> I'll also be able to actually keep like, um, you'll also be able to actually keep tabs open and stuff like that uh, on like browsers, which can be very important if you're like managing um, your like redeems and stuff like that. There's also the fact that you can run programs like tits and whatnot, which is very, very important. It's a balancing act. Oh, come on. This is... <sighs> this is annoying. There is no way I got that, so I might as well retry. Um... Yeah. It's just much I think I agree in the in the department there I'm glad that we're all on the same page Come on. Okay. I think I got it that time. Um. <laughs> this is a Corby stream. It is a Corby stream. That's okay, though. I don't mind hearing about people's setups. I am upgrading my own very, very soon, hopefully. So... And that's why I kind of wanted to discuss it, because one, it's a question that isn't asked very often about which you should prioritize. Like, um, 
aspects of the PC or uh, your camera, because saving it for a PC would take longer, but it improves everything overall. Whereas a camera, a lot of people, if they saved up for just a couple months, like a month or two, they would probably be able to afford a better camera. And so the question is, do you want to save up for like almost a year or and get a PC? Or do you want to save up for like a month or two and get a better camera and then save up for a PC? Oh, oh, he he went above. They went above and beyond both of them. Okay. Uh, was that good enough? Ah, that one took even longer. God damn it. Yes, it's Kirby Day, Grizz! Oh, cursed Kirby time. Cursed B, if you will. I'm I'm very excited. I love Kirby Day. Kirby Day is a good day. You know it's a good day when it's Kirby Day. I'm doing this treasure road, which is stupid annoying. I think I got it that time. Hell yeah. Look at that. Ooh, a nice lunch and a date with the wife. Oh, that's so fun. Oh, I hope you had a good time. That sounds lovely. What'd you have for lunch? Now I'm curious. Now you gotta tell me. You gotta tell me about your lunch plans. I got an I got to know what you had. Oh, this. Open. Thank you. Literally. Mexican, ooh! That sounds lovely. I hope it was a good time. I hope you enjoyed yourself. I hope it was a nummy. Cause that sounds lovely. I haven't eaten much today, personally. I had like a bag of chips. <laughs> I should probably eat more. I think I also had some ice cream, but that was, that was about it. Cause it's kind of warm here right now, but. What? 
And I'm planning on getting pizza later, probably, though, which is super exciting. Uh, but I'm glad you actually had a good time. <laughs> uh, I, okay, do you want to know why I don't have an Eat Redeem? Because I can tell you why I don't have an Eat Redeem. I don't have an Eat Redeem because I don't want to bother people with misophonia. I don't want to. I don't want to upset them, because I understand that it's already super hard to deal with the world when you have misophonia. That's like the main reason I don't have an eat ready. In fun fact, is because I don't want to hurt anyone with misophonia. Yeah. Played bonk. <laughs> Did that play for you guys? It didn't play on my end. I didn't hear it. So I need to make sure it played for you guys. Did you guys hear the bonk? Oh, it was late? Okay. Um, My, my headphone might not be on. Um, thank you for the posture check. I'll do that now. Uh, thank you for the hydrate, Jay. And thank you both Jay and No for the, uh, eat salt. I will eat salt twice. Salt one. Salt two. All right, Bonk was playing. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, no comes out of lurking to make you eat. Yeah, I know. Eating is very important. I agree. I agree. <laughs> I just don't get hungry in the morning. What has salt in it? I don't want to know. Here, I'm going to test my headphone. Okay, I heard that one. All right, I fixed it. But I know, I know, I know food has salt in it. I'm aware. <laughs> yeah, I am going to, I'm going to be having pizza for di for dinner tonight. So don't worry. And I do snack during um, break. Don't worry. I just wake up in the morning and I don't get hungry. That's, that's what happens because of my GERD. So <laughs> I don't usually eat breakfast uh because i get sick in the morning so if i eat too soon after waking up i get really really sick and i woke up really late today because i always wake up late on wednesdays wednesdays and mondays i wake up really late um i sleep in it's my sleep in days <laughs> so i don't i don't have enough time before stream to eat I like I don't have enough time to like get my stomach in a uh, normal cool in a uh, normal standing so I can uh we go huh. oh there's more <laughs> you and me both brother sister sibling what the fuck? 
<laughs> um... <laughs> Food was the surprise <laughs> after all. Salty surprise is dirty. <laughs> it's my job to be... Yeah, Jay and Grizz, you two are the reason why I can't fully call myself a say so VTuber. And I'm okay with that. I like being I like being mildly say so. I like teetering on the edge. No, I'm not a Lootuber, but I sure as hell don't make fully say so jokes. Um I'm an any. <laughs> Something about saying I am an any. Like not uh, I go by any. I, I am an any. I think I got it. Maybe. Uh. Hell yeah! Um. I agree. You gotta be able to make jokes. Yeah. I mean, the thing is, is like, if somebody who is say so collabs with me and is like, hey, can you be completely say so? I'll do it. Like, I'm not afraid to be say so. I just, for me personally, I don't really see the point of being fully say so because i'm like i can i can just vibe like i am chill with making jokes that are it's over a fucking road oh that's so funny anyway i am cool with being any like i am cool with making jokes that aren't for children and aren't for like um in like sensitive viewers like obviously i'm not gonna make jokes that are doing or saying something that is uh not you know friendly to like easily upset folks like obviously i'm not gonna say shit that's offensive but like it might be too mature for some audiences and i make that very clear in my content same with my like video essays like you guys haven't really seen much of them because i have a bunch written and don't have any actually recorded i'm saving them for uh future stuff but my uh video essays are all very adult oriented oh my goodness a raid Doug dimma dale dimma dimma dog did dimma dale da da dimma dom dom dimma dim dom a duck dog dimma dom da da dale da dimma dimma dale dom dimma dog dog dimma dom anyway i don't know who raided me i'll i'll check in one second oh shit uh give me one second <laughs> Thank you so much for the raid, whoever you are. While I'm figuring it out, uh, tell me. Oh shit! Hello. Okay, we're gonna restart. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Hi, hi, sheepy. Oh my goodness. How are you? How are you doing? Cat Nubis. <laughs> oh, which cat is it? Chat Nubis. Here, I got it. I should mod you, Grizz. I should. Hold on. 
All right. Uh. Oh, it did not. Fuck, I misspelled sheepy. <laughs> I hope you guys like the music. It's so good. Did that one work? Okay, thank you. That I think I still misspelt it. No, it, it, it worked. Okay. Hello, everybody. Hi. <laughs> yeah, I can give you mod privs. I should give you mod privs. I need another mod in my chat. <laughs> I trust you to not be stupid. <laughs> and also, you have over 999 messages in my uh, chat. I'll do that. I'll do that now real quick. Oh, I'll do that later. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everybody. Hi. <laughs> oh my goodness, Fuzzy Bottoms. I love your name so much. Thank you so much for the follow. All right, let me read up real quick. Sorry, I was in the middle of, of uh, being a car, so I I didn't I didn't see <laughs> everything. But hello, Sheepy. How did how did stream go? How did uh how what were you guys playing? What were you guys doing? Did everything go well? Also, hello, Necro Aegis. Welcome. And I Fuzzy Bottom, welcome. I hope you guys are doing well. <laughs> I'm feeling okay. I'm trying to get the shout out to work. <laughs> oh my gosh hi hi desert i see you over there um obs was being bad to me game was fun though oh that's awesome i'm gonna get this version of the shout out to work work my claw bot doesn't want to work sorry about that um so everyone says it's such a good name it's so cute <laughs> um but no, what was OBS? Was OBS being a little stinky? Was it being OBS has been mean to me today too. I've I've had a bit of scuff today. Not a lot of scuff because I set up my OBS in a very specific way to where it's very hard to become super insanely scuffed. But even my OBS has been having issues today. So I think OBS is just OBS is needing a patch. I bet. I bet. I'll probably check for updates after stream. But. Um, for those who don't know me, hello everybody, I'm Lord Ramsey's your resident pharaoh back from the dead. I am a variety streamer, I play mostly games, um, and whatnot. Uh, I like playing whatever comes to my fancy. Uh, and I make very stupid jokes. <laughs> I think I'm funny, I'm probably not. Um, I'm also a very active member of the LGBTQ, and, uh, I am a disabilities advocate as well as a pagan, so you'll hear me talk about those topics quite a bit. Uh, they come up quite often in stream. Me commenting on my own life with disabilities, as well as being a member of the LGBTQ, and talking about random pagan topics when I feel like it. So, uh, those are things you might hear a bit. Um, and if that's interesting to you, feel free to stick around. Uh, Sheepy, if you need to go and take care of yourself and go do your post-stream self-care, feel free to do that. You are good to do so. Thank you so much for entrusting your community with me. I appreciate it so, so, so much. It always is really nice to see you drop by in any form, right or otherwise, so... Yeah. Crucible the Fox, thank you so much for the follow. I also love that name. <laughs> <laughs> Every time I hear the word crucible, I think of like science stuff. It's very fun. Um, it disconnected five times. Oh no, mine's only disconnected once during my starting soon screen. Oh no. <laughs> oh, you weren't following Sheepy, Grizz? No, you gotta follow Sheepy. Sheepy's amazing. I, I like to lurk in Sheepy's streams because they're always super chill and... Honestly, I, I I like to uh, just just hear them talk sometimes, like just hear them ramble on about whatever they're they're doing. It's fun. I like having background noise, so I like to lurk in people's streams. And if if you are my background noise streamers, then uh, consider it an honor because it means that I can um, just kind of keep working while listening to you ramble. I could tell you suck at lurking, Grizz. <laughs> you like to comment on everything. You're so easily distracted. <laughs> oh, you like to look at mine? Oh, that's so sweet. That makes me happy. 
All right, so what we're doing right now is we're playing Kirby in the Forgotten Lands. I'm trying to do this stupid car challenge. And I keep falling off. <laughs> I keep falling off of the uh, platforms. Uh, okay. Oh, God. Whoa. All right. I missed one. Where is it? Oh, no. <laughs> Which one did I miss? I l try to log in this stream every damn day. I do stream like almost every day. Uh, the only day I don't stream is Sundays as of late. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm live every day. I get people who ask me, they're like, Ramses, how the hell do you keep up with it? And I'm like, uh -uh, mm -hmm. I don't think about it. <laughs> I just do it because I'm having a good time and I'm falling off of this ledge and I can't be doing that. <laughs> also, I think I... My follower goal does not say it, but I think we've reached... Last night, at some point in time, while I wasn't paying attention, uh, probably, I think it was while I was asleep, during stream last night, we hit 199 followers, which is super exciting. A bunch of people followed. And then I think because I raided Crow, um, a bunch of people in his community uh, got wind of me for some reason. And uh, somebody from over there followed, which was very cool. Very nice of them. Um, so we started the stream shockingly. Oh, I see it. At... Uh, 200 followers, which I'm going to make a Twitter post because I didn't realize we were at 200 before stream. Uh, and now two of you lovely, amazing people from Sheepy stream followed. So now we're at actually 202, which was one of uh, my goals. So that was very cool. Thank you, guys. It's been awesome entertaining you all. I've been having a blast streaming. It's so cool. Um, bro. <laughs> No, <laughs> I am just being the worst. Uh, no pro gamer here. Just, just terrible gamer. <laughs> I promise I'm a good driver. I swear I'm a good driver. <laughs> I swear I've never been in an accident. I swear. <laughs> okay, never mind. I hit a sign once. <laughs> Only once though. <laughs> oh, that was a... Oh, God. Oh, no. No. <laughs> Fuck. All right. Let's try, try that again. Okay. <laughs> this is probably one of the funniest treasure roads I've ever done. Um, but yeah, I'll probably be making a, a Twitter post about hitting... 200 followers, because that's a huge milestone. There's like a, a bunch of people that I know who haven't gotten past 100, which is super cool to me that I've managed to get so lucky that I am still growing. Uh, Drifto Kirby. <laughs> but no, I'm really glad that I'm still growing even after streaming for about a year. Like a lot of people will fall off around that time. So I'm very, very honored to be part of the uh, still growing gang. Streaming's hard. <laughs> it's fun, but it's hard. Boof. Go. I I will do it. I, I promise. I promise. Okay. All right. I do love I, this Kirby got some junk in the truck grass every time. I do enjoy streaming. It's it's definitely one of the highlights of my days as of late. I've loved doing it. It's been a really good time. Um, I do recommend streaming uh, to people who like entertaining, but I will say it's not easy to grow so if you're interested in growing it's gonna take a little bit more time um but even if i'm a tiny streamer forever i'm having a good time and i'm no point five three seconds Fuck. no <laughs> oh damn it that is so unfortunate it's not even a full second it couldn't even be a full second all right 
listen here, you little shits. <laughs> we got this. Uh, but yes, that is the key. I do, I do love streaming. It is super fun. I don't think I would have uh, sunk as much effort into it as I have. Um, I think, I think the the true testimony to my love for streaming is my lore video, like my um, lore debut video, which was. It's so difficult to make, but honestly, one of the most enjoyable projects I've ever worked on as a creator, just generally, like as a creative person, not just as like a streamer, um, not even as a, like just a streamer, just like as a, as just a creator, my, my lore video was so fun to make. And the ending is my favorite with strange and the Pharaoh's curse. <laughs> I think I laugh about it still to this day. I see it in my like folders and stuff and I, I'll just watch it sometimes. Cause when Strange sent that to me, I lost my shit. Uh, I will be suing. God, it was so good. <laughs> Everyone who worked on that project was amazing. If you if you haven't seen the project, I recommend looking at it. It's very clearly made by a bunch of indie artists and that's okay. Um, so if you haven't seen my lore video, it is up on my YouTube to check it out. It's, it's really cool. Um, but like, <laughs> otherwise, like it, the people who worked on that are so talented and I cannot recommend them enough. <gasps> Uh, come on, we got this. Unless you grow a few inches, you will always be a small streamer. Fuck you. <laughs> I, I don't even remember if I told you how tall I am. Did I make it this time? No! 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 God damn it. I am being tormented. <laughs> Oh, God. All right. No. All right, there. Okay. Why is this game so difficult sometimes? It's just this game is a little mean. No, fuck me in the ass. Oh, I don't think I made that. Uh, I had ankle. <laughs> I have ankle biter energy. <laughs> Yeah, you know, that's a fair statement though. I do I do 100% have ankle biter energy. I may not be super short, but I do in fact have ankle biter energy. <laughs> oh, that's a fair analysis of my personality, I think. Me think. Okay. We're going for that, that targeted time. Come on, we got this. We got this. All right, that was a flawless maneuver. Oh, oh, 
I think I got it that time. <gasps> Did I make it? Hell yeah! Look at that! <laughs> He's pretty tall for a dead guy. I... Listen. <laughs> I'm not that tiny. Fight me. I'm not that tiny. <laughs> Fight me, desert. <laughs> I'll square up. <laughs> Oh god. Okay, so we'll do co mouth, ring mouth, multi mouth, and then we'll go back to the Waddle D town and do Storm Tornado. Uh Cone Mouth. Pierce the floor, up and down tower. We got this. What? Oh. No, not the scarfies. Not the scarfies. Anything but the scarfies. The scarfies are jerks. <laughs> Bites Ramsey. <laughs> I bet I don't taste very good. I <laughs> something tells me rotten flesh won't taste good. But just just a just a just a thought. God, this is a problem. Oh no, hit. Yeah. Oh. Huh. Oh, I don't know if I got that, but I really hope I did. Oh, oh no. God. <laughs> Okay, wait, wait, wait. F fuck on him. <laughs> Why is that a considered a, a sex word? What? Oh my god. I don't know why that's considered that. That's so annoying. It's more of a jerky than something that is actually <laughs> Oh my god, I'm gonna fight you. Um... Can't be buying an Egyptian god to, to do list. I'm gonna bite you. Um... <laughs> I got you covered. Uh, dry age, then rot. I'm just dried out. I just need some moisturizer. Okay, no, bite should not be considered a sex word. I know why, but I don't think it should be. I I don't think it should be. All right, here. There you go, Grizz. Congratulations. You've been you've been promoted. <laughs> I don't know if this is going to be a good thing or a bad thing, but congratulations. You've been promoted. All right, so I'm going to return to Waddle D Town and get some speed juice. 
Because <clears throat> I'm going too slow. I need to be moving Sonic speed. I should play Sonic on here. <laughs> yeah! Yeah, look! You have a little sword now. <laughs> Defender of the auto mod. <laughs> <laughs> Roxy Potato Crime on top. <laughs> oh no. Pants, <laughs> everyone! Grizz now! <laughs> you don't need to do that. Whoa, that's cool looking. Oh. That's cool. Oh, whoa! That was a little, little, little big. Holy shit, look at it go. In the door. Deep sleep. I want to know what this looks like. Oh, that's so cute. He looks so tired. What does this do? Walk to bed and get all cuddly cozy. You show everyone your full potential after you wake up. Huh? I have to go to bed? Kirby becomes God? Oh, there we go. Oh, look at him. He wills a bed into existence. Whoa, he's so fast now. <laughs> Bands auto mod? No, I need that. <laughs> I require the auto mod. Unfortunately, I don't want to, but I do require it. <laughs> Cause sometimes y'all aren't here and I can't pay attention fully. Wrong bed? Yeah, it is. It is in fact the wrong bed. <laughs> I would wear that hat to bed, I think. Okay, so now that I'm so fast that the world can no longer tell that I am just a ball, um, we're gonna go back and try the fucking traffic cone again. Cause fuck that traffic cone. Don't actually fuck a traffic cone, thanks. Uh, but fuck this traffic cone. Cone B. What is my stream tomorrow? I think it's Assassin's Creed tomorrow. I don't remember. <laughs> Y'all can't fucking stop me. <gasps> Whoa, 
whoa, whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm fast as fuck, boy. Fast as fuck. <laughs> I love that meme so much. <laughs> I need to make that a sound, like, genuinely. <laughs> oh, I don't know if I got it. No! <laughs> I know exactly where the time slip was, too. Fuck. Okay. <laughs> Cut you. <laughs> Instructions unclear. Crotch run over by traffic. <laughs> oh no! I think I've I've read about a about an actual incident like that, or somebody got a little too excited by concrete. <laughs> I'll let you figure that one out for yourselves. Like Lightning McQueen. Oh shit. Huh. Oh yeah. <laughs> People are very weird. People are very, very weird. Uh, <laughs> um, to be fair, Grizz, you are part of the people are weird thing because of what you sent me the other day. That is all. You are part of that group. You are part of the people are weird group. Unfortunately. Um. Storm tornado. I look. <laughs> I didn't ask for it. You said, here, I'll send it to you. So you, so you just ripped the bandaid off and I went, no, wait. Oh shit. Nice. <laughs> I even sent you a mild one. Yeah, I don't I don't know how mild that was. I was saving you. 
Oh my god. <laughs> I was gonna look it up, and I did end up looking it up because I was curious and I wanted to see what the non-mild shit was. And now I'm scarred for life so much so that I can't even remember what I saw. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> I think the the, the big freak ready. Nice. I don't know if I got it, but uh, here's hoping. No, so close. Big regretty was in fact had. Uh, and I will always. Okay, look, it was worse than the clippy art. That's all. It's worse than clippy art. <laughs> <laughs> Does anybody wait? No, no, I can think of one thing that's worse, and that's copy from Tumblr. Because there's some very unokay art of copy. Please don't remind me. I will remind you of Clippy until the day I die. If I must suffer through Clippy, so must you. It's like uh, the game, which you all have now lost, by the way. Oh, I can send you the Clippy, Grizz. Would you like to see the Clippy? I can send you the Clippy. Damn, I lost the game! I don't know if I made that. Oh, it was even longer. Um, uh, the next Kirby after Kirby is finished. Um, 
I was thinking about that actually. What should be the next uh, Kirby after Kirby's finished? Like the next uh, comfort game after after Kirby. Um, I don't know. I'm hoping Moonlight Peaks comes out soon because that's what I want to sub in as like the, the game I play when I'm not feeling good is Moonlight Peaks. Uh, Animal Crossing is another one I was thinking about. Um, but I just don't know. Yeah, I could just keep doing Kirby games, too, because I do... There are a lot of them available on Switch. I wish they would make uh, Red, Blue, Yellow, Fire, Red, Leaf, Green, like all of those games available on Switch's emulators. I really, I really wish they would, because I want to play them again. I want to play them on stream. <laughs> the next Kirby is what, Jay? <laughs> no, I've already seen that art. No, I've already seen that art. No, I've already seen that art. I've already seen it. Like, I'm not joking. I... 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 The Smash Brothers fandom is cursed. That's all. That's that's all I'm saying. Um, that art was forced upon me. I did not consent to seeing it. I did not like it. <laughs> and do know it does exist. <laughs> um, but no, I can I can backtrack on Kirby games. I can do that. I can also just play like random retro games. <laughs> there is no way. Yeah, there is way. I have seen so much illicit Kirby art. <laughs> and I hate it. I hate that I've seen so much of it. Um, <laughs> I don't appreciate and I don't want to. <laughs> know that you cannot traumatize me more than I already am. Even if I see something unpleasant, it will not be a new trauma. <laughs> Other than Hornet, apparently. Hornet was pretty bad. <laughs> Alright, come back to this one. <laughs> yeah, that's what? Hornet or Kirby? I've seen a lot of cursed art, I'm not even gonna lie. I found a new method. You have not seen the things I've seen. I can... You're literally a child. You don't know. Aliens are weird, dude. We don't know what's going on here. the Kirby art though I will be transparent on that it's so bad but again I've seen I've seen more uh I've seen art of the Wii balance board um so like you know 
<laughs> I've seen art of copy, the copy machine. I've seen art of Clippy. I've seen art of the, literally, and I've seen art of that one guy that it has the jack-o'-lantern head that like was dancing on the news like ho uh, during Halloween ten years ago. I've seen art, of, <laughs> seen art of that. Um, there is nothing you can show me that is worse than what I've already seen. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, desert? You care to repeat that? <laughs> cursed art? You wouldn't mind cursed art of the Wii Balance Board? <laughs> Grizz, you should show me the things you've seen, because um, I want to see how bad they are. <laughs> Can you tell I hate myself? <laughs> Not actually. I don't actually hate myself. I just like torturing myself. I'm a bit of a masochist. I think I got it. Yeah. I mean, Tumblr's the people who measured Luigi because of this. <laughs> Don't forget about what Map Hat did. Don't forget about the one Luigi episode. Don't uh, uh, from April Fools of like 2019. Don't forget about that. Um, want to bet? Yes, I want, I want to bet. I want to see the cursed shit that you have. <laughs> I do want to taste. I want to know. I want to know. <laughs> do it. Do it. Show me. I want to see it. Cursed shit is my, like, lifeblood. I fucking love cursed shit. I should start posting more cursed stuff on my Twitter. My Twitter is very like bland and it makes me sad because I see all these other people posting cursed stuff, but I'm afraid people will like, start hating me if I post cursed stuff. And it's upsetting because I really want to post cursed stuff. <laughs> no, send me your cursed shit. I want to know. Cur Kirby, the master of mouthfuls. <laughs> Excuse me. Are we the master of fun now? Oh boy, we're gonna become a water bottle now. Cool. 
Water balloon! Car time! Oh no, car on ice. Ah. Oh, this is so fast. Oh God. I hope I made that. Yeah, I made it. Um, I love seeing stuff that makes me think this shouldn't be real, but here I'm looking at it. Yeah, that, yeah, that's pretty much me. I said it too, but I forgot to spoil or one of them. No, now I'm looking. All right, let me look. <laughs> Pulling it up on my phone. <laughs> the one you didn't spoil is so good. <laughs> no low balls. <laughs> I know what I got. <laughs> I fucking love that. What is even the first one I'm looking at? Oh, I see now. Yeah, that's bad, but that's not awful. <laughs> Although I didn't I didn't think anything could bend that way, so you know. It it just be that way sometimes. Sometimes you could just contort your body in ways that it shouldn't go. <laughs> Alright. Um Let's do in the presence of the king. I don't I bet one of them is don't get hit. Boss fight time. Maximum tomato. Um, we'll do Storm Kirby. I bet it's DDD again. Yep, it is. This conversation. Bug Pokemon images are weird. You're right. Nice. How about one is swallow the hammer? It's like he's a boar. <laughs> Clear within two minutes. That was easy. <laughs> -na 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 -na. All right, cool. Hi, 
hydrate. I can hydrate. <sighs> Finished off my water. Cool. Okay. Clear by using a second level of all ability. Don't get hit by Forgo DDD's fire attack. And then the last one I bet is don't get hit at all. Are you a friend now? He's a friend now. Oh no. Run! Kirby, you got this! <gasps> oh no! He sacrifices himself! <gasps> DDD's dead. What is this? Welcome visitors to the Dream Discoveries Tour of our science facility, Lab Discovera. On this thrilling tour, you'll be introduced to the ultimate life form, Specimen IDS 86. It's Alphalin. It's Alphalin. What are these? Thirty years after our research began, a warp experiment incident occurred in this facility. A new life form, separated from the main specimen, escaped in the aftermath. That new subspecimen has yet to be recovered. In the time since, IDS 86 has shown no signs of activity. It is now kept in a state of permanent safety within the custom-made Eternal Capsule here on the top level of Lab Discoverer. And here we are. Let's meet the ultimate life form, Specimen IDF-86. Oh no. I don't like this. This is a very apocalyptic thing. <laughs> what the fuck is that? Take a good look, pink intruder. Isn't this a beautiful sight? Uh, I think I think I'm looking at an alien fetus, and I don't appreciate. You're not even seeing the Great One in full form. They're incomplete without their other half. Long ago, the Great One granted the people of this world a miraculous power. Those people left this world behind and entered a land of dreams. Once the Great One is complete again, I know we will also receive this miraculous power. We, the ones they left behind in this forgotten land. 
What? So the humans, that's what happened to the humans? They just kind of left? I bet they're all dead, but like, they just left for a dreamland? And now the time has finally come. Oh, there's Elf. I knew it. <laughs> I knew it. I knew Elvalin was a villain. That's right, this small creature here is the Great One's missing half. I figured. Finally, after all, excuse me, all our planning and effort, we can help the Great One reach their complete form. We've dreamed of this moment for so many years. If you dare to stand in our way, we'll feast on your hide. Oh no. King of the Beast, Leongar. Oh shit. Oh, that's horrifying. Oh, God. Uh, uh, no thanks. <laughs> we go <laughs> nom 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 yeah really oh <laughs> oh spleen it does look like a spleen it's already too late alpha Lin. oh god alpha moves so fast i still don't trust you you, you dare. Plan ruined. Important plan. Needed labor. Open vortex. Found workforce. Brought here and yet error made. Irksome pink contaminant. Careful planning. Now wasted. No more planning. No more patience. Instead. Everything shall be cons... Oh god, that's horrifying. <gasps> what in the fuck? Oh no, it's a run sequence. <gasps> oh no, invasive species, Fecto Forgo. Oh god. Huh? <laughs> 
Why are you doing that? Oh, this is... This is not good. I... Thank goodness. This is terrifying. I don't like this. Thank God. No, that's a that is an actual abomination. Oh God. Evelyn. I knew it. Villain. Where are we going? Zoom me. Okay. Um. The the switch does not like. Uh, ice is pretty great. I like ice. We're moving into the final boss now. Uh, I forgot about the delay. I was thinking Chattanooga was a psychic. No. <laughs> yeah, this is the first time Kirby's fought for something that isn't food. You're right. Oh my god. This is horrifying. Oh, that's such a cool design, though. Ultimate life form. Fecto Elphilus. Dude, that's pretty. Oh, this is so intimidating. Oh, this is intimidating as fuck. Oh, shit. Why do you straight up look like a Final Fantasy monster? I'm cheesing this so hard. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, we're going the Marks route. Oh no. Oh my god. This music's really good, though. Oh, 
<laughs> Did you just fucking heal? You little bitch. Oh, this music's so good. Oh, God. <laughs> Oh man, they're moving faster! Oh shit! Okay. Huh. We're we're making progress here. But damn, this guy's health is fucking beefy. Yes. Oh, I'm just Oh my god. No! 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 Oh my god, he was about to stab Kirby! <laughs> he is the ultimate life form. Who, Kirby? Kirby is the ultimate life form for sure. Oh god. Oh yeah, that 100% has Curse Start. I know it does. Such incredible power. Whatever it's trying to do, it's going to be pretty bad. What is it, Kirby? Whoa, is that Planet Popstar? Is that your home? That's Planet Popstar? Oh no, it's pulling Popstar through the huge vortex. It wants your world to collide with this one. Damn, what are the people on Planet Popstar doing? We have to stop it, but how? The tr Wait, no! Kirby, no! <laughs> truck! The fucking truck. <laughs> We're gonna go full truck on this. We're gonna isekai this bitch. Uh Oh my god, the music! I feel so fucking powerful. Oh my god. I'm on a, f I'm a fucking truck, guys. I'm a fucking truck. <laughs> I am going to hit God with a semi. <laughs> oh, are you guys seeing this shit? <gasps> I have never felt more powerful in a game than being a Kirby semi truck. <laughs> Oh my god. Let's go! <laughs> oh! <laughs> Hell yeah! <laughs> the only time I've ever enjoyed a quick time event. <laughs> go, Kirby! <laughs> Let's 
Let's go! Yo! <laughs> you can't win! This is... <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> What's Meta Knight doing there? All this, just kind of watching it? <laughs> I said I was gonna fight God, not that I was gonna fight fair. <laughs> Who would win? Powerful life form hurling an entire planet at you or a truck? <laughs> Goodbye, Alphalyn. You've caused so much trouble. Why are you- you're so fuzzy, oh my god. You're a literal stuffed animal. Goodbye, Alphalyn. Oh, poor Kirby. He's so sad. Oh, he's back. Elflin's back. Elflin cry. I <laughs> Mennonite. Oh. Oh, this music. Oh, this is such a good song. Oh my gosh, the alien language at the bottom is so cool. <laughs> I vibe. Look at all this. Oh, Dedede's alive. The beasts are now friends. Cool. Excuse me. Oh, they're eating green apples. What'd you guys think of that game? Thoughts, feelings on this? Did you guys enjoy it? <laughs> Alphalyn best? I will say Alphalyn's one of the better, uh... Villains, Kirby villains. Still like Magalore more. Like Alphalyn better than Sparks. Definitely has a lot more of a of a kind of dramatic buildup. I feel like this this was a good step for the Kirby franchise. I feel like because I feel like Kirby as a franchise has been kind of stagnant for a hot minute. Like. Since Return to Dreamland, it, it felt like it's it stagnated a bit, and this felt like a return to form. It was very nice. Granted, the stagnation was only like three or four games, but this felt like a, a very welcome addition, I think. A very nice welcome addition. Elflin is a hero now, but Elflin wasn't always a hero. We can both admit that. Oh my god, Chloraline eating a cake. These photos look so out of place. Star Allies is fun. Star Allies is fun. I'm not super in love with Star Allies because it's not fun unless you have like friends to play with in my opinion like i like star allies it's just like it doesn't feel like um 
like a, it doesn't it doesn't feel like it has as much a love care and attention as some of the other kirby games i've played it felt kind of rushed to me like it wasn't a bad game at all but i definitely ap appreciate playing it with friends a lot more than playing it solo i think <clears throat> If you have friends, though, you can 100% break that game, and that's really funny to me, <laughs> that you can just cheese your way through it, so long as you have, like, one person playing, um, Sparks or Magalore, it's great. <laughs> one day you do late stream, we play together, I think that'd be fun, I think that'd be silly. Oh, ew. I don't know. You're gross. I don't... I don't like... I don't like... Nice! <gasps> the fourth gacha pong! Gacha Machine Volume 4! There are more new figures to collect. Oh my gosh, a band! The Waddle D the Waddle Live Con Corner Stage has been rebuilt. Put in a request to hear your favorite tunes. <laughs> Coliseum has new challenges. You can now enter the ultimate cup in the Coliseum. Battle tough opponents and aim to become the champ. To enter the Ultimate Cup, visit the booth in front of the Coliseum. Want to increase the power of a copy ability? Good news, copy abilities can now be powered up at Waddle Dee's Weapon Shop. Nice. Yeah, Evelyn? Oh, Coraline! Hey, look! Chloraline is visiting our town. She looks a bit upset. Hmm. Ah, are you thinking what I'm thinking, Kirby? When things finally calmed down and the animals came to celebrate with us, Leongar was missing. I bet Chloraline has been looking for him. She might have found something. We should ask her what's going on. All right. So, oh God, that jumped us up to 73%. Okay. All right. <laughs> okay. We put the Kirby tibbies away. I could put the seesaw back on <laughs> all right so we're gonna go take a quick break um it i've been going for two hours and anybody who's watched my streams long enough knows that every t at the two hour mark like halfway through the stream i take a 10 to 20 minute break so that's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna go take a break go get something to eat uh go get something to drink and possibly order dinner so yeah i'll see you guys in about 10 to 20 minutes all right all right enjoy
and we are back with my stinger still being very jank hello everybody i hope you all are well i uh, hope you guys had a good break i had an okay break but i am a little annoyed because uh, my pizza shop that i was gonna order pizza from is not taking uh orders for later being like a couple hours in advance so i'm a little pissed off um but otherwise, I'm doing okay. I'm doing all right. I had a small snack, but I'm saving my appetite for pizza later, which is going to be very exciting. Um, and yeah, uh, we have some dialogue from Alvel in here that says, When I severed the connection between our two worlds, I used up all my power. I blacked out. But Claroline found me. She kept me alive. That's how I was able to see you again, Kirby. So if she needs help, then I volunteer. All right, let's go check up on Claroline then. Go so glad to be safe with you again, Kirby. Wow, they built a corner stage. Looks like that band is named the Diddly D. <laughs> the Diddly D's. <laughs> Can we stop and listen? Maybe they'll play requests if we toss star coins into their star case. Um. Oh, that's nice. Oh, look at them dance! I love watching them dance. Short. Look at them go! Please don't inhale the cinema, patrons. Oh, I like this song a lot. Okay, I like... <laughs> Can I stop sneezing, please? I don't even have, like, allergies or anything, really. I'm gonna go for... I don't know what auto does. I'll just let them play. I don't know why it's giving me the exclamation point, but... Is this another mysterious vortex? What? You sense Leonger somewhere in there? Oh. Well, 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 this is all right then. <laughs> I guess we're going in whether we want to or not. Oh. Oh my gosh. This feeling. This is exactly how it felt when I was absorbed by my other half, Fecto El Elphilus. It's possible that after that big battle, Leonger became trapped in this strange place. Come on, Kerber, we have to check it out. Huh. Isolated Isles, Forgo Dreams.
Forgo Plains. I want to see what's all here. This place feels like it's made of super strong psychic energy. Let's be careful. And there's the... This is cool, though. All right, to Waddle D Town. Yeah, we'll go back to Waddle D Town. Um, and Wonderful Younger is okay. We've got to find him. Well, first, we got to collect all the rest of the D's. We got to save the rest of the Waddle D's, Alphalin. Gosh. Thankfully, that won't take long. Because I don't think there are any really in here. Yeah, because that's just the lab discovery. Uh, there's no Waddle Dees in that, thankfully. Um, yeah, no Waddle Dees in there. Uh, it's just the ones in the DDD fight, I think. Ugh. Don't get hit by Forgo DDD's fire attack. And then unknown which is probably just don't get hit if i had to assume something um actually you know what no nah. i'm gonna see what weapons are down here because i don't remember okay ice is in here snatch Cheese in all the way. I got the cheese. Okay, well. I gotta restart now. <laughs> so I got hit by the attack that I was trying not to get hit by. DDD's uh, fight is gonna be a little difficult to remember the pattern for, I think. I wish I could just, like, skip this part. Oh, I thought he was already dead. No, he's not. Oh, shit. You can't do shit. <laughs> he just pierced himself. Oof. That's a big oof from me. All right, cool. Don't get hit by Forgo DDD's fire attacks. Nice.
No, don't get hit. Clear without taking any damage. That's what I thought. I got really close, though. Six out of seven. Last one. Clear without taking any damage. So here's where we uh, wrap up. Alright. All right. Oh, what? What? No, nah, that's bullshit. <laughs> I didn't even know that was an attack. Since when was that an attack? All right, well... Let's go get some of the food and the speed juices to make this a little easier. But I didn't even know that was a fucking attack. Rude. Rude ass. I'll just get one of each because I don't think I'll all need them really elsewise. <gasps> Whoa! Huh? <laughs> it's just a little star there. How nice. I'm also going to check in here to see if any um, weapons can be upgraded. Guess what, Kirby? I found a way to make your copy abilities even more powerful. I just need a few rare stones to raise your attack power. I'm calling this process Ability Power Up. I'm ready to power up your abilities whenever you are. Pick a favorite and we'll try it out. When you power up an ability, a plus will be added to show that its attack power has been increased. Use that extra power to beat some hard bosses. Um, I guess I'll do ice first then. Damn it! I don't have 1,000 coins. <laughs> That'll be an easy amount to get, but, you know, I'm lazy, so we're gonna just immediately go square up with DDD again. Gosh, so much lava. If we don't keep moving, we might start to melt. All right, let's go beat up DDD.
Nice. Come on. Okay, cool. Oh, come on. Ah. Uh... Unfortunate. That's rude. Unfortunate. Okay. And now I gotta click through this all again. I don't- I wish they just like let you quit out <laughs> after you beat the game. Make things a lot easier. Like if you have Ethelin in your party, you let that be the trigger for like being able to just click out. I think that would make things a lot easier <laughs> on everyone. Uh, I'm missing literally one D, one D and it's so unfortunate. Okay. Okay. Cool. All right, you want to know something really cool? I can't power up the sleep. I can do this and then it should just Yay! Now my stuff is is set up for free. It just gives me speed. Rude. Well, this should make things a little easier, I think. Um... All right, let's try this one more time. Um... And... 
Nice. Yes! Nice! Oh, wonderful. No damage taken, because he didn't use the one attack that... It's like, there's two attacks only um, that break the ice shield that he has, and they're the only two attacks in the game that I've ever seen break the ice shield. So, <laughs> you know. <laughs> A little hard to cheese, but I I've cheesed it. And that's all that matters, so long as, as this game has been sufficiently cheesed i think it's okay <laughs> all right we will skip through all of this yep and now exit the stage all right so we've gotten all the d's all oh, waddle d's saved you saved all the Waddle Dees and Redgar Forbidden Lands. And now I have every Waddle Dee. Huzzah. Okay. So, hello, Hope. How are you? I hope you're doing well. Uh, would you guys like to see me continue the plot or go to the Coliseum? Yay! Golden Statue of Evelyn! <laughs> Golden Statue of Kirby! Because we saved all the Waddle Dees. <laughs> yeah! You saved every Waddle Dee! Thank you, Kirby! As a show of appreciation, special statues are now in the town plaza. Hell yeah. Statues of us right in the middle of town? Aww. Okay, so this is all good now. Um, yeah, a gotcha redeem. I do have a gotcha redeem. I do, in fact, for games that have uh, a gotcha in it, because not all all games have gotchas in them. This is this is one of the games that does have a gotcha. <laughs> We'll just continue with the plot because I think that's a lot more interesting. Um, zero out of 50. Four go planes. Is it just like them all like one after the other? I think it is. I think I just have to play through literally the entire game again. But now that I'm not like having to redo levels, this will be really fast. Oh shit. Hell yeah. You got a piece of Leon's soul. Wait, is this Leongar's soul? It must be a tiny fragment of it. If you collect more of these scattered soul pieces, you might be able to save him. Try to collect more of Leon's soul as you explore the isolated isles of Forgo Dreams. That is fucked up. Alright then. That is so messed up. Another one. I can get a bunch of money this way, too. Hell yeah!
Nice. Gib. Nice. All right, we're we're really making progress here. He needs some milk. I feel like I've I've missed hmm, it might be up there. So I guess I'll I'll check. Cause like I don't see where it would be here. Oh, wait, I see it. Snatch. Nice. Ooh, that gave me three. Cool. We got eight. We're doing pretty good. Gun time. Nice. Okay. Um Nice. Oh my gosh, we're doing really good here. Look at this. This is I am. Hello, Goro. How are you today? Hope you're well. Hope you're vibing. Oh, jeez. Nice. Hell yeah, but no, I hope you're doing well, both Cordo and Hope. Thank you for dropping in. Thank you for vibing. We're just playing Kirby in the Forgotten Lands. We've beaten the game proper, so now we're just doing all of the, like, uh, post-game stuff. So, yeah. Oh my gosh, it's Crow. Hello, Crow Van Crow. How are you today? Thank you for popping in. Um, just got home, stuffing my face before I finished SMT3 in a couple hours. Ooh, sounds fun. Hope you have a good time. Sounds like a wonderful time. I am picking up a pe pe pieces of a guy's soul right now. Oh shit. <laughs> ah. The ghosts, they're after me. Yeah, look at that. All right. I feel like I've missed a piece somewhere. Oh, hello. Oh, fuck. I love the Meta Knight sword ability so much. It's so good. Living in Spain without the A. <laughs> Yeah. I 
feel like... Uh... Am I... Is this a secret? I don't know. I'm gonna backtrack. Fuck! <laughs> Balls. Ignore me. It is a damn shame that they didn't make those little wings flip when Kirby floated. Ah, yes, the vending machine. Uh, you wanted to see my reaction? I'm sorry. I kind of guessed it, though. That Elflin was somehow, like, uh, connected to the villain. You don't just play a Kirby game and then, like, your partner in crime not be connected to the villain in some way. That's just... That's not Kirby. It... it you either get betrayed or, like, close to betrayed. There's no in-between. Otherwise, you're not playing Kirby. You're playing something else that looks like Kirby. Yeah, vending machine! Vending machine! You get to become a vending machine. It's so great. Uh, <laughs> yes, I uh, I love Kirby so much. Kir I, I love all the Kirby games, honestly. I have some that are more loved than others. Like, I this is one of my favorite Kirby games, I think. Because um, it's just so funny and silly and goofy. But uh, I I love Kirby. It's It's a great franchise. It's one of the few franchises that I'm like... Yeah, you can't really go wrong with Kirby. It's always good. Um, to a Japanese habanero spice bottle for 91 cents, but the website asked me for my prefecture and even denied my Amazon account because of my location. Oh no! <laughs> That's so unfortunate. Uh, let's see what else. But yeah, vending machine. You should. I recommend playing this game. It's really goofy. Um, reminds me of the isekai where someone got reincarnated. Oh yeah, I do. Re <laughs> I know exactly what you're talking about. I have played only one curb game. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. I know exactly what game you're talking about too, because that's one of my favorites. Um, I remember playing that game as well. Um, and it's on the. That game is, I believe, on the Game Boy emulator on the Switch, so, you know, worth, worth investing in, perchance, if you already have a Switch, that is. Wait. Um, but no, my favorite Kirby games, I think, are, um... Superstar, I love Superstar. Uh, Return to Dreamland, and this one. The, these are those are my favorite Kirby games. Fucking Hellfire. All right. I I see how it is. Nah, fam, you you're not getting me twice. I don't even see them the first time because I'm blind. Ah! Ah! <gasps> How does one get up there? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I think I know. Oh. Oh, that gave me bomb. Oh, I love that. Nice. Give me part of his soul. I love that Kirby is low-key a god. <laughs> if you know, you know. Uh, if you don't know, fun fact, Kirby's a god. <laughs> I hate to be the one to break you this news, but Kirby is canonically a god. Ooh, money. I like money. How do I... Okay, so... There was 100% something back that way, though. 
Um, yes, it is on the Switch. It is, in fact, on the Switch. It's part of the Game Boy emulator. Um, there's Isekai Kirby. Yes, there is Isekai Kirby. Um, <laughs> Isekai is very weird. Uh, I hate that because I cannot argue against it. <laughs> Kirby, okay, look. Kirby has always been a god. <laughs> if you hadn't known. <laughs> uh, Kirby is canonically a god. Um, I don't remember exactly where they specified, like, which game it was, but there is a game where they're like, oh yeah, no, Kirby is a god, essentially. It's Meta Knight who says it. <laughs> it's like, I don't even remember if it's one of the games. I, it could have been, like, the Kirby manga. I don't fully remember. But it was like, oh yeah, Kirby? Kirby's a god. <laughs> and it's like, oh no! When? <laughs> it was like, oh yeah, Kirby's a god that's 100% gonna destroy this world. And it's like, oh, <laughs> I see. So yeah, um, Kirby's only a hero by choice. Also, can we just talk about how true neutral Kirby is as a character? Because, like, he is motivated by only his self-interests. <laughs> and just saving people comes secondary. <laughs> like, if you play through every single Kirby game, you, you think that he's, like, altruistic, right? You think that he's, like, self-sacrificing. And then when you actually pay attention to his motives, you start to realize that, no, he just wants his food. He's not, he's not helping people. He just wants his fucking strawberry shortcake back. <laughs> and that's it. Like, he is not. He's not, like, helping people because he actually gives a shit. He's helping people because he wants his damn strawberry shortcake. Or to return home, which is the case in this game. He wants to go home. And that's his, like, motive in this one. <laughs> Looks like you've already collected all the pieces of Leon's soul in this spot. Let's check the next area. Nice. Oh, let me... Free me! No! 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 Ah! I have not seen that anime. Uh, yeah, for, he, he is very hangry. <laughs> Who would win? Actual gods who have proven themselves with many, many nation destroy destroying powers or pink round boy. <laughs> that is literally the plot of most modern Kirby games. <laughs> Look at, okay. You want proof other than this game where he actually does fight God? Um, Look at, uh, um, Return to Dreamland. Because Return to, uh, not Return to Dreamland, um, Superstar. Look at Kirby Superstar. I think Ultra specifically gets more in depth with this. But if you look at Kirby Superstar, right? And you just like pay attention to Sparks, the, the main villain of the campaign for that game. Other than like, like if you pay attention to that, right? Uh, like, the main, like, kind of, like, campaign villain. You notice that he makes a wish upon a star, right? And this star is actually, like, this, this ancient technology created by a superior race of aliens. And <laughs> what ends up happening is that um, he wishes for, like, ultimate power. For the ability to destroy and create worlds. Which is literally a god. That is a god, if I've ever heard of one. And so, he wishes for this ability to, like, destroy and create worlds at his whim, right? And Kirby just goes, I bet, let me just slap you with my sword a couple times. <laughs> And you're trying to tell me Kirby ain't a god? 
<laughs> you literally killed two! Like, Kirby just kills gods for the fun of it. It's just his hobby. <laughs> and what's even worse is that it's also canon. He doesn't even realize he's doing it. <laughs> Oh, I love Kirby so much. <laughs> the, the game series is so chaotic. It's amazing. <laughs> He's just a little guy. Yeah. <laughs> I have fun fact for anybody who's curious. I have um, I have this really big Kirby plush that I got at an anime convention. And this thing is fucking chonky dude like it is so big and plush it's like as big as my chest like it's just my whole chest in 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 height and width it is a big chunky boy and he is so fucking cute i'm gonna see if i can dig him up from storage uh in the future no not the ads <laughs> I'm so sorry. Um, it probably was a really good sword. No, it was just a normal sword with the Link hat. <laughs> uh, no, Kirby games weren't always so wild in lore. That That's like a 2000s thing. Love cream puff. Cream puffs are so good. I'm gonna be honest. Anime Harry Potter ripoff. Is that just a fantasy MHA? It might be. But I'll have to check it out, uh, Mashley. I'll check that out. Welcome back, Kuro. Um, but no, for anybody curious, I do love I do love me Kirby because I have this absolutely massive Kirby plush. So cute. I saw. I I'm gonna be honest. I I buy into Kirby capitalism. It's the because the the Kirby merch is so cute. Okay, I can't help it. It's adorable. <laughs> His little stupid face, like. Look at that face. He, there's no thoughts behind those eyes. That boy, he's not thinking a single thing. <laughs> and yet somebody gave him bombs. <laughs> there's not a single thought behind Kirby's eyes at any... Like, look at this. He's a traffic cone and he doesn't give a shit. Look at this. <laughs> oh, Coneby, how I love you. <laughs> it, it's worse when he becomes stairs. Because, like, his mouthful modes are wild. Like, there's vending machine. There's stairs. There's car. There's, uh, ring. Um... Okay, I just wanted to make sure there was nothing under there. <laughs> and there's... There is not. This is a really long level. Oh my god. I've been here forever. Don't forget truck. <laughs> yeah, no, Kirby becomes a truck. Like, <laughs> Kirby was wild, guys. Hell yeah, I got a star. Oh yeah. <gasps> no! <laughs> I fell. <laughs> Fuck. Get out of here. Oh, okay. Oh, oh no, 
Oh no! Oh no! No no no! No 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 no! <laughs> okay. Christ. God, Kirby is intense. Um, Kirby is that one child at the playground that always changes its powers, but it is always something silly. You're right. <laughs> Traffic code Kirby's just how I feel. No, can you imagine? I should make that post. I should make that tweet where it's just like, which Kirby are you feeling today? <laughs> and it's just like, oh, we're going up against the boss now. And it's just like traffic cone Kirby, um, car Kirby, truck Kirby. Like, how are you feeling today? I I personally am feeling, um, God, why do you look like that? Whoa, neon gorilla, strong armed illusion, phantom gory mondo. Oh, God. Oh, damn. Oh, shit. Oh god, run Kirby, run! Oh shit. We got this, we got this! <laughs> oh shit! Damn, yep, gotta fight Phantom versus all the bosses. Yeah, I figured as much. Uh, voluptuous. <laughs> God, you guys should have seen the cursed shit Grizz was saying, like, in earlier streams for this game. It was so bad. Grizz, Grizz, like, makes Kirby not innocent. I, I hate it. <laughs> Uh, how many did I get? Ah! Fuck, I bet it was all in that last section. Hey, Gal, Blizzard Ice! Done a beautiful tiara of ice and become a frigid force of nature. Use this ability to skate around enemies, then stop them cold with a volley of foe freezing icicles. Brr. Nice. Um, cumbersome, shiny, and voluptuous, so I suppose so. Very waddly. <laughs> I'm down <laughs> to hang out with Traffic Comb Brioche. Brioche is great regardless of, of their form. Uh, hey, I didn't put the tibbies on stair. Kirby <laughs> his hands! <laughs> They're his hands! I'm gonna keep telling you, they're his hands! 
<laughs> All right, I'm gonna put Kirby to bed real quick so that way he can heal. And you guys can see the super cute sleep animation. You know this game is a good... Okay, my... My my parameters, right, for deciding if a game is good or bad is if it has a fishing mini game, and this game has a fishing mini game, so therefore it's a good game. <laughs> Look, here it is. Here's the fishing mini game. Look at how how big this fish I caught was. Look at it. It's so big. It's so rotund. <laughs> Look at this big ass fish. <laughs> Hands with no arms on the front of his chest. Look, does Kirby have arms? Look, does Kirby have arms? D like, not arms. Does Kirby have have? What does Kirby have actual arms? Look at these. Look at them. Look at them. They go. <laughs> they did not think out this animation. <laughs> He's so chonky. <laughs> Sorry we disappeared on you, Chloraline. The space through that tiny vortex is so weird. It's made from powerful psychic energy. I think I've been in that place before. It just felt like getting absorbed by my other half. Long Gare must be stuck in that mysterious space somewhere. We'll keep looking for him there, okay? Just hold on a bit longer. Yeah, we got this, Chloraline. Don't worry. Into the hall. They had the materials and manpower, and instead of upgrading the home of the hero who saved their life, they built a coliseum. Hey, hey, well, it looks like Kirby's actual home. Kirby is simple. Kirby doesn't need anything special. So only one piece of Leon's soul left to find here, but where? So I missed one here. So wait, I missed a piece of his soul here? I bet it's in the water. So I missed a piece of Leon here. Somewhere. Oh wait, is that it? No, I already collected that piece. Is it just going to give it back to me? It's going to treat it like money. Got it. Hmm. Where's this piece of Leon I'm missing? At least it gives me money. There's that one. Is it behind here? No. Hmm. It's not up there. Is there a secret over here? No. Hmm. Nice. Okay. Um, I still don't. Huh. All he needs is food. 
Dude living in an ugly rock igloo. Okay, he's happy. He's got a comfy. All Kirby cares about is whether he has a comfy bed to sleep in and some food. He don't give a shit about whether his house is big. Don't burden the little soft pink alien with your human desires. He just wishes for some sleep and some food. And also, I relate to the fact that Kirby loves strawberry shortcake because that shit slaps. And I don't understand why the, the cake in this game, in these games, always looks so much tastier than the cake in literally any other, uh, any other like setting. Like, I have never seen a strawberry shortcake depicted or made as tasty as looking as Kirby's strawberry shortcake. Like just, just period. Full stop. There's like no, no way that that those that cake was made by like a deity. I swear. I swear upon. It. Looks like you've already collected all the pieces of Leon's soul. Let's check the next area. Hell yeah! So now we can move on. Man, that was a good spot, I would say. Not a fan of actual strawberries. Give me the cake and the syrup. Okay, that's fair. But I disagree. I do love actual strawberries. They held him no feast. His bed could be so huge. Literally always falls off. He's okay with that though. Like, look, he's so round. He's so round and so bouncy. I'm sure he doesn't mind actually falling off of things. Um, he's just a happy little guy. That's all. Let him be happy. They give him food and that's all that matters to him. If you guys haven't seen Kirby right back at you, by the way, totally watch it. It's really funny um, and really cute. Lots of cute Kirby moments in that show. Very much worth it. Gib. Thank you. Next area. My jaw hurts. I don't understand. Um, there must be two pieces hidden around here. All right, so there's two pieces of Leon's soul. <gasps> oh, God. <gasps> Did y'all see that? <laughs> How he just fucking fell off? Bruh. Oh man, poor Kirby. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about me. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just looking at some things. It's okay. I wonder, can this feels like I should be able to go inside, but I apparently cannot. Why does this game want me to have sword so bad? It really wants me to have sword for some reason. Okay. I 
feel like I need to... Nope, I guess not. Mouthful! I am vending machine, Kirby! Oh. Come here. I love that vending machine, Kirby. Just gives you free health. It's so good. Like, Kirby just drinks the fucking soda. He just, like, swallows the cans whole. And... Oh, hell yeah! So, I'm missing one more now. And I bet it's hidden in a similar way. See, arms are on the side. Yeah! Yeah, look, they are arms! You're right, Grizz! They are, in fact, arms! Would you look at that? You're proving my point, Grizz. That they are not Tibdies, they are arms. I... It's gotta be around here. Hmm. I'm missing one more. I'm missing one more part of... Leon's soul, so... Is it back here? <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Ignore that, nothing happened. You saw nothing! This way? Where? The up and down thing? Up. Up. <laughs> I was just under it. Okay, so... Is it this thing? The other up and down thing? This one? Oh my gosh! Grizz, you're a genius! <laughs> Looks like you've already collected all the pieces of Leon's soul in this spot. Let's check the next area. Grizz, you're incredible! <laughs> Damn! I would have never seen that. <laughs> nice. Thanks, Grizz. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All 
All right, let's move in this way. Okay, cool. <laughs> that was a really good catch. Uh, uh, that, that was really nice. All right, I think we got all the pieces in this area. All right, so we can just kind of like move on here. We need to speed run through this section because we've got everything. Unless we want like extra coin, which I don't think any of us really care about. All right. We got this. Yeah. All right. Hard part over. You little bitch. Oh, fuck. My sword. <laughs> All right, now we're getting through this part. Just to just to open it up cuz I want the hamburger. Nice. All right, so Yeah, freeze. Oh, I would love some fries. I'm not even going to lie here. I sound delicious. Um, I think we got all the pieces of Leon's soul in this area. Great. Um, so I think it's just the, yeah, it's just one in the last area, I think. So let's speed run through here. Oh, uh, yeah, there's nothing I could have done about that. Ice cream! Yeah, there was no catch on that one. All right, hop up, hop up. All right, we got food. You little bitch, get out of here. All right, in we go. So now we're in this area which has one piece. There's only one piece left to find here. And I have some ideas. All right, so now we can come through here. That pulls that down. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, so there's not anything under there. I feel it. <gasps> Aha! Ha ha ha! Nice! No! Okay. <laughs> There's nothing I could have done about that one. No! Ah, oh, shit. Alright, we're just gonna... Nice. Okay. Maximum tomato. Okay. Fight the boss. Oh, shit. Why is he double cheeked up on a on a fucking Wednesday afternoon? judge <laughs> look at his colors game it's so insane it gives me a headache and then on top of that he's double cheeked up on a wednesday and that's 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 an interesting uh combination there all pieces it's very nice of evelyn to tell you whether or not you're in an area with pieces buzz saw cutter what's the buzz cut <laughs> what's the, what's the buzz cuz I... <laughs> this cutter evolution has increased power and flying distance it'll also ricochet off wall so aim carefully to send it extra far clink clank buzz that's cute i like that All right. We're at 50. 75%. All right. So I'm not scared because I've got you right by my side, Kirby. Right? Right. <laughs> Cute. All right. There's only 48 here. Interesting.
Get out of here. here no oh wait I could just like oh look at these little fish why are there fish in a dreamscape what's going on here <laughs> Yeah, you're frozen now. There's nothing you can do about it. <laughs> you're dead. Goodbye. Mr. Iceman. Actually, I don't... I don't think... Looks like you've corrected all the pieces of Leon's soul in the spot. Let's check the next area. Nice! But I do want to collect this money. Well, that one was really, really easy. I'm kind of shocked at that. Good night. Hell yeah. Seagull. <laughs> so cute. So how we all feeling right now? You guys vibing? You guys feeling okay? You guys thriving? Oh, I see. All right, take that back. Nice. I might as well just keep the gun. They're doing a lot of gun tricks in, in this level for some reason. Nice! Money! I remembered that from <laughs> the original level, like the the true level. You're vibing! Oh, that's awesome. I'm so glad. I get worried sometimes when I'm streaming that people aren't enjoying themselves. So I like checking in every now and again to make sure you guys are having a good time. And if you guys wanted to let me know what you want me to do, if you want me to change anything, because I don't mind that. 
I like improving. Is there anything over here? I'm I'm missing something. Oh wait, do I have to remember the wait? Okay, there we go. I was so worried I was gonna have to find the whirlpool in the original level, like relocate that whirlpool in the original level that actually takes you to a sub level. That's what I was worried about for a second there. <laughs> I was like, oh no. <laughs> but no, I'm good. I'm 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 solid. <laughs> Alright. We got all the pieces of the soul. Look at that. We're doing so good. Do you see how fast we're moving? It's incredible. Oh, shit. <laughs> Don't mind me. Oh, my gosh. Are those takoyaki? Mm. I love food. Okay, listen. It's such a damn shame that I have GERD because I fucking love food. Like, I, and I don't mean like I love food, like I just love eating because that's not necessarily the case. I just love flavors, you know? I just love how things taste and how they feel in my mouth. It's very nice, Stim. I am a food Stim person. A person that stims via taste, and it's it's very interesting. I don't know many autistic people like that. <laughs> Not many, apparently. Mmm, rice ball. <laughs> I'm just, I'm all over the place with, with the food I want right now. <laughs> Pizza, rice balls, takoyaki. There are these like little chips, that, like I, they're kind of like chips. Um, they're like uh, these like puffs. They're like corn puffs, but they are flavored like takoyaki, and they are literally my favorite thing. Like I've had people be like, "Oh, Ramses, what do you what what chip do you want?" And I'm like, "The takoyaki corn corn puffs." And they're like, why? <laughs> Looks like you've already collected all the pieces of Leon's soul. Nice. We are moving. We are schmoving and grooving and moving. I'm so glad they made the ultimate sword one. Meta Knight's Mask. Because it makes me think of uh, how in Superstar, if you swallow Meta Knight's sword, you wear his mask. And it's very, very cute. He's just barely moving. I love that for him. All right. I think I found the one there. Nice. Oh, shit. There we go. Nice. Nope. Give me my ice. <laughs> perception who's she because i don't fucking know her apparently
There we go. Can I? Please. Kirby. Kirby. Thank you. Aha! I knew there was something here. Aha! Yes! Yes! Okay. But I didn't get all the, um... I have to go back, because I didn't get them all. And so, we retreat. To be frank, I have one eye. I do, yeah. My other eye is not functional very well. It is the one eye gang here. Okay, so here's the beginning of the level. I'm missing like one or two, I think. I don't think it would be in this room. remember seeing I don't remember seeing Alphalyn say oh we've gotten all the soul parts here you can't just say that <gasps> rude yeah I mean he just did so <laughs> I don't know <laughs> I don't think can't is the right word. More like shouldn't. <laughs> um, have you, do you, do you, have you all seen? Have you all seen the... I have not seen the soul piece.
Is it in this area somewhere? Hmm. <laughs> this is a free chat! Fuck you, chat noobus. <laughs> You're such a nerd. Alright, I can't find it, so I'm just gonna mark that one as done for now. Look, I'm Stair Kirby again. Oh wait, I can... Hold on. If Stair Kirby is immune, right? Hold on. I gotta... <laughs> gotta see if I can... Damn, I can't. No! Gorb! Alright, we got this. Oh, I can retry! Oh, that's so nice. Okay, cool. Because I'm like, there's no way. <laughs> like, that would be so frustrating. Oh, uh, this game is very nice to its players. Alright. 
Okay, now we can pick up all of these coins. Kill that fish. And that should be all of them in this area. Right? There's no more? There should be no more here. Aha! Looks like you've already collected all the pieces of Leon's soul in the spot. Let's check the next area. Hell yeah! Look at that! I am also so excited for pizza. I really want pizza. All right. Uh, who is it that we're fighting? Oh, it's Wispy. Phantom Tropic Woods. Oh, you're you're throwing Gordos this time. I forgot Wispy Wiz was one of the bosses in this game. Come on, we got this. We can do it. He, uh, I don't think he is in every Corb game. I think he's in most Corb games, though. That's a clusterfuck of a boss. Holy shit. <laughs> that was a, a really big clusterfuck. I have to do it a second time. <laughs> Ta-da! I'm missing one in the one area, I bet. Wild hammer. This hefty hammer is made from super tough stone. It's too heavy for quick hits, but each powerful swing will deal explosive damage. You'll even crack the ground itself. Nice.
New area open. Forgo Park. Ninety-seven. All right, so I'll return to Waddle Dee Town, get some of the stuff that I need. Um, let's see. Life up! All right, and we'll increase my life. Um, Maxim Tomato. Hell yeah. Uh, also, I want to check with this guy to make sure that we didn't... Do not use. I want to know if I've... Ah, uh, King DDD has the blueprint. Isn't he in town? So far, the number of times you've inhaled objects. 997! King Dedede is in town. Where? Where? Welcome to Waddle Dee Cinema. You can watch all kinds of movies here. Are you wondering why we built a cinema so soon? It's well, it's because entertainment is important. So which movie would you like to watch, Kirby? These are all so cute. Feel free to stop in any time. Oh, there's a strange message in this pa pamphlet. Kirby's story. This must be the hidden present code. I've actually already redeemed it. <laughs> Thank you, Alvalin. Um, I gotta find King DDD real quick. Because he apparently has... A blueprint. Okay, valid. Chat go sit. Let's go sit. Bottle D's are fishing too. Where is DDD? If I were a giant penguin, where would I be? And yes, if you didn't know, DDD is a pe- There he is! I love his design in this game. Hi Kirby, been a while, hasn't it? Oh my god, you talk. <laughs> I didn't get to say it before, so thanks for saving King DDD. Speaking of, he seems to really like this town. He's been wrestling to help himself heal. Actually, we have something to give you. It's a blueprint from King Dedede. A gift from the king. What an honor. Masked hammer blueprint. 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 Uh, he waved at me. He looks like a, a, a penguin from Club Penguin. What? Was that a masked hammer blueprint? Yes. Yes, it is, my buddy. My guy, my man, my dude, the man, the myth, the legend. Cool. Oh, you have a fourth one? Oh, that's, that's a shame. Instead, I power it up. Nice! Blizzard Ice plus two. Oh, it does even more damage. Alright, so I'm hungry. Um, so I think I'm gonna call it here. Because I'm hungry. I need to go get something to eat. So I know it's like 50 minutes early. 
but I, I want food. <laughs> so I think I'm going to end it here. Um, does anybody have anyone they would like me to raid? I'm going to see who's online. Um, let's see. Ooh, Draconic is live and so is Rika. I think I'm going to send you guys over to Rika. She's a sweetie and she actually helped voice... She voiced Isis in the, um... In the, uh... Debut lore video, so go check her out. She's really, really sweet. Um... And I, I recommend her. And... Thank you, Rakro, for coming. It was so nice having you. I always like seeing when you're in chat. It's been lovely. You've been coming to the streams recently, and it's been very awesome to see you. I've also been enjoying lurking in your stream. So next time you stream, you're going to catch me there. Watch. Just watch. <laughs> all right. So with all that being said, thank you so much for watching, everybody. Um, we will be playing... Uh assassin's creed tomorrow so if you want to see me die a bunch of times as i try to sneak around um as well as uh murder some people and gush about uh ancient egypt uh feel free to stop in same time same place um with all that being said thank you so much for coming everybody take care of yourselves and each other and i'll see you next time Senate.